250 million tons of CO2. This tremendous number represents the CO2 emissions induced by the manufacturing of construction products. Construction products and buildings are the main source of waste generation in Europe, with 30% of the total waste of the continent. One thing is for sure, the facts and figures to support the assessment are not lacking. No one can deny that it is a major issue. That is why the EU has embraced several laws to regulate the building industry. Examples of such initiatives include the CEAP. The EU's Circular Economy Action Plan paves the way for a cleaner and a more competitive Europe. Mapping out 54 action as well as four legislative proposals on waste. This ever-changing regulation creates difficulties for construction companies. And on a local scale it is even more complicated. companies must be accompanied to understand the legal framework. Moreover, using reused and refurbished products at a large scale requires an expertise that the construction and building services companies don't have yet. Who says being sustainable must be complicated? Not RBD360. Indeed, with our project RBD360, we want to make it easy and achievable. With the help of experts from the building industry, we worked very hard for days and days to find a solution that could include all the stakeholders of the building industry. A solution that above all will help construction companies and renovation companies to be low compliant. A solution that enables to democratize the use of recycled products in the building service industry. And finally, a solution that includes the circular economy with a holistic approach. To start this adventure, we focused first on electrical components. Indeed, we have come to the conclusion that the challenge is in the building finishing work, because structural building work components are already easily reused. Electrical components represent a growing market with a compound annual growth rate of almost 3% in Europe by 2026. Electronic components are highly valuable assets necessary for construction. Moreover, maintenance and renovation of electrical installation is required, making our project highly profitable. The circular economy is not new. But what makes it so difficult to be embraced by companies is the lack of traceability, reliability and systemic approach. For the traceability part, we cover the whole journey of the product from its extraction to its refurbishment and its reintroduction in the economy. We want to raise awareness on this practice to democratize it and encourage producers to provide clear information on the product's components. To deal with the reliability, on the other hand, we have a strong partnership with insurance companies, which enables us to certify our products. We have developed a unique expertise on the electrical components we sell, thanks to the license that our partners provide to us. To democratize the circular economy in the building industry, it is important to adopt a systemic point of view. It is time-consuming for construction companies to deal with several suppliers to get new and reused products. That is why we have chosen a holistic approach providing new components and second-hand components on the same platform. Let's have a first look at what RBD360 looks like. In our marketplace, renovation companies can find second-hand options for the products they need to buy. We deal also with companies who want to dispose their waste to be more low compliant. Electrical components are just the beginning of our long journey. We aim to expand to other highly valuable assets related to building finishing works and building services.